A new Nobel Prize winner can be found right here in Seattle. Scientist Mary Bronkow was awarded the Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine earlier this week. Comos Claire Weber caught up with Bronkow today to see how she's feeling after joining the select list of Nobel Prize scientists. Claire? Preston, the award was announced on Monday, the first of the 2025 Nobel Prizes, but Brunko actually learned about it when a media photographer knocked on her front door at about 3 a.m. that morning. Now, speaking with her a few days later, she says the honor still feels surreal. Things are starting to sort of settle down a little bit. and A whirlwind 48 hours. You know, I've had a little bit of time to process and really understand the impact of what's happened. As Seattle scientist Mary Brunko receives the highest honor in medicine. It's gratifying to see how meaningful a Nobel Prize is, you know, not just in the science world, but more broad than that. Her discovery made in the 1990s has been a launching point for studying our body's immune system. You know, I mean, worldwide, there's been, you know, awesome work done in the field that has, you know, been a result of what we did. Brunko and two other scientists uncovered the importance of regulatory T cells and the role they play in immune tolerance. How the body maintains a balance between an immune system that needs to recognize and neutralize things that we shouldn't have in our body, like microbes and viruses, etc., and making sure that that process doesn't get out of control. Now, years after stepping out of the lab, you know, everything happens on a computer. Brunko has seen her research improve treatment for autoimmune diseases and cancers and the success of organ transplants. I'm proud and humbled. As for the past few days after news of Brunko's award broke, it has been overwhelming the amount of, you know, support and well wishes and everything that have come in from all over the place and from all different parts of my life. Today, Bronco works as a senior program manager at Institute for Systems Biology here in Seattle. She will attend the Nobel Prize award ceremony in Sweden in December. Live in Seattle tonight, Claire Weber, Como News.